U.S. Military Academy cadets this week are defending their school status as the reigning champ of the National Security Agency's annual cyber defense exercise. Today began the third day of competition. The contest has gone international in its 15th year, with the Royal Military College of Canada joining the fray. The cadets and other competitors have a bit of disadvantage. Each morning they report to their computer rooms at 8 a.m., but can't sign on and resume the competition until 9 a.m. At 10 p.m. they must sign off the computers, but the folks at the NSA and DOD can continue working through the night, trying to poke holes in the students' defenses. Cadet Ethan Gliu of Salt Lake City explains. All right, so right now the competitive team um, has had our stand-up at 9 o'clock. Um, so right now we're, we're trying to get our systems back online and kind of correct uh, some of the problems that the NSA um, have created and some of the vulnerabilities that they've exploited. Uh, and so we have about 30 cadets on the competitive team here and the exhibition team about 24. Uh, so we're both uh, working through all those problems and uh, trying to get our network online, um, increase access and availability, and secure our other file systems. The competition concludes at 10 p.m. Thursday. And because scoring adjustments are sometimes made, the cadets and their fellow competitors won't learn who won until sometime Friday. For Record Online, I'm Eric Gleedman.